Hello folks, beginning with here once again. Right now we're heading to Coffee War 331 station. It's a new tourist destination around Satahip. So if you haven't gone to the place yet, join us and let's have fun! Alright folks, so let's have a little history about Coffee War 331 Station. So, kailan nga ba ito nagsimula? And bakit ito naging patok sa masa? So, tingnan po natin and let's see kung maganda ba talaga ang place nito. So, hold your breath, sit back, relax, and stick around kasi talagang mag-e-enjoy ka dito. Basi daw sa Patayan News, this business is owned by Mr. Damri Santang. So, isa lang naman siyang former Royal Thai Navy officer. So, kaya siguro pinangalan tong place na to as Coffee War. Kasi ang mayari naman pala is an ex or a former Royal Thai Navy officer. And the fact na this place appears to be located sa Road 331. So, kaya yung pangalan niya, Coffee War 331 Station.
Ayan, we're here at Coffee War 331 Station. Alright, so if you are from Bangkok, it will take you about 160 kilometers or nearly two hours to get to this place. So, sa Satahip to Banda. Pag sa Siracha naman kayo, I think it will take you around one and a half hour lang. Once you're here, uh, you will find old Airbus A330 uh, that has been converted into a coffee shop. So, marami siyang old planes. May dalawang malalaki, tsaka yung iba, mga war planes, tsaka passenger planes na maliliit. And aside from those uh, planes, may mga trucks, may mga cars, mga military vehicles. So, ang dami niyong makikita once you arrive at Coffee War 331 Station. So, before kayo makakayak dito sa plane, uh, kinonvert as a coffee shop, kailangan niyo muna mag-sign in sa baba, mag-scan for temperature check, Tapos, bibili kayo ng ticket. So, that ticket, uh, mga 100 lang siya. Kasama na yung drink. And then, yun na yung ticket mo. Para ka lang sumakay din ng plane na may ticket. So, yun ipapakita mo to get your drink. So, once you have done that, you can start roaming around the place, taking pictures, taking videos, whatever you like. So, talagang napaka the best ng place nito. As for when did it start, I really don't know exactly when it was officially opened. But when the place started to accommodate visitors, tourists, nag viral po siya. So maraming reviews, uh, maraming tao na pumupunta, and then that time, crowded talaga yung place. So at the end of June last year, the coffee shop was ordered temporarily shut down after it became too popular. Kasi nga, nung nag viral it was drawing hundreds or even thousands of people a day. Kaya ginyan nilang kapatok sa masa ang tourist spot na to. Ang pinaka na gustuhan ko dito is you can take pictures whatever you like. So pwede kang nasa loob ng vehicle, nasa labas, or pwede ka rin pumatong sa dapat na 
papatungan. And in fact, yung iba dito, nagko-costume pa sila ng you know, army or military. So talagang napakaganda na uh, gawa ng pictures or kuha, kuha na ng pictures tapos ilagay niya sa Insta, sa Twitter, sa Facebook or any sort of social medias. After a few weeks, since dumadami at dumadami ang tao, the public health officials had to ask the coffee shop to close for a week. So hoping na sana it will help to cool down enthusiasm and hype around the old jets. Now, na open na ulit sila, they are ensuring na talagang safety ng mga customers na bupumunta dito. So, andyan yung temperature checks, tapos talagang naka-wear ka ng mask all the time, and regularly disinfects surfaces. So, pag nag kayo dito, you should know na only 60 customers are permitted on board at any one time for a maximum of 40 minutes. Kaya, itodo mo na ang picture taking and kunan mo na ng video lahat ng sulok ng plane tsaka gawin mo na dapat ang dapat mong gawin.
So once again, this is Coffee War 331 Station at Sata Heat. So malapit lang po pag galing kayo sa Siracha, it will take one and a half hour. But then, if galing kayo sa Bangkok, mga nasa dalawang oras naman siya. So, have fun and enjoy the rest of the view. Bikini man, subscribe! <laughs>